Okay, let's say someone hire you for consult or someone hire you in order to help them out and technically you want to have a consultant agreement with them. Link in the description you'll find a uh, consultant agreement and you will see also how you can use it in order to help your business grow. It's technically a template. You need to adjust it so it can help your business grow. That's technically how you need to see it. So when you have a consultant agreement, it's important that you see the following. When you have a consulting agreement, you need to ask yourself, okay, why do I need an agreement? Why do you need an agreement in this case? Is because let's say this is the agreement. This is you as a freelancer, doesn't matter. And this is your client, can be a big company or whatever. The thing is, let's say this is a company. The thing is they come to you for consultant and you provide their services and they pay you money. Technically, they pay you money, you um, you provide them consult. can be anything. What you need to keep in mind is this is important because sometimes you um, you don't want to waste your time and technically it's important that you be clear what you're going to provide them. So all those things you're going to put in the contract. You put, for example, at the beginning, who are the party? Who is this? Who is this? Where are they? And why do you guys go into an agreement? Why do you guys create a consultant agreement? And the body, the, the thing that's necessary, and then make sure that both people sign it. That's technically it. Another thing that's important here is the IP, intellectual property, and the government law. Those things are really important. Why? Intellectual property, if you are giving them music or things to use, you want to know and make sure that it's clear what kind of permission you are giving them. And when there is a problem, it's important to know which law apply. That's why the government law is really important. So these two things are really important. And not but lot, uh, but services is also important. So keep in mind when you look at services, it's important that you put clearly in a contract what kind of services are you going to offer. So if you want to know more about this or if you have question about it, go on the Discord, go to the support ticket. And create a support tech and i will try to help you as soon as possible if you're new to the channel seriously subscribe it's for free you see the subscribe button press it it's for free i hope you guys like this video i will see you in the next one